Hello everybody, I am Brantman19 and we're playing some more Supreme Ruler 4th German Reich and uh, a lot's gone on. Uh, we have taken a considerable amount of land, especially in uh, Central Europe and quite a bit out of Eastern Europe as well. Uh, Northern Europe is pretty much mine except for Finland and uh, most of France is ours over in Western Europe as well as the Netherlands and I think that's it. I think that's the only one I've bitten out over here. So. Anyways, we need to go ahead and finish up this war against France. Uh, it shouldn't be too hard, honestly. They're, they are lacking so much money. They're actually negative 26 billion in debt right now. They cannot fix that. And uh, that's hurting them every single day. So, uh, let's see here. I'm pulling... I don't have any troops really to send to the fight from over here. I'm repairing a lot of troops over here. And while I'm thinking about it... I want to go ahead and take a little precaution out of the way here. And I have a ton of already. It's we need it's just what happens over time. And uh, there's something I want to do with it all. All of my artillery, all of my anti-air you know, defenses, stuff like that, I want to go ahead and I just want to get rid of them. And the reason why I'm doing that is because, well, I don't use them a lot. And they will just keep building up and up and up. And... If you don't use them, they don't get destroyed, you don't need them, you might as well get rid of them and uh, start getting as many just normal units as you can. Right now I've I've clicked so much out of, let's see, I'm at about 100 right now and I'm still going. There it is. So, 119 units I've selected of 275 are all AA or artillery. I don't need that many and I'm paying for every single one of them. So. I'm going to go down here and take care of this one as well. Alright, so we're now down to 165 units total. Uh, probably less because garrisons. But that's what I wanted to do. That, that'll that give me a much easier uh, focus here. I will go ahead and take down this place too. And now whatever gets built out, I can be pretty much sure that, at least for a little while, it's going to be exactly what I want. Now let's, which are just attacking units. We have 48 production facilities. It's not going to take long to fix that gap in AA or artillery if I need to. And look at that. Lots lots of M2 Pumas and Leopards and transports. Yeah, we, we've got that all under control. Okay, that place is almost done. I want to get rid of this pocket. And these guys are just pushing. We do need to secure that border to make sure Spain can't get down there at that either. Okay, we'll grab these guys. Come on, you're going to come take on uh, Brieve La Gillard. Gillard, I can't... Man, that's a weird one to say. Okay, the Babs are done. We've taken that spot. Come on down. Come on down! They're sending their units to Avignon. Avignon. All right. I'm just having fun trying to pronounce names of these places. I know I could be like butchering it really bad, and I'm probably pissing off some people in France or and all that. I, I just I don't know. If you never try, you can never do it. You got you got to try first. All right. We'll send these guys over. I'm just collecting units that are sitting in towns behind the lines. There you go. I want you to go for this place, Clermont Ferrand. And then we'll go after Lyon next. And also these southern units. What's that right there? Oh, that's their mortars. Yep, they still have mortars around. They still have units. They're going to keep fighting back if they can. I don't want them to roll over, honestly. Don't make it easy. It's a game. It should be hard on me. Alright, there's both those places. Let's secure that. They're gonna go this Montpellier. We're gonna go ahead and take Perpignan. There you go. Send these guys on down. Once we take that, we will own the entire border with Spain from the French side. Alright, that looks good. 
Looks like the UK is... Well, they're rebuilding some of these spots. They'll never rebuild the channel completely. Uh, we'll have to hope that that does not get destroyed whenever we do attack them. We'll probably need to kind of rush it with no artillery and hope for the best. That's, that's really what it's going to come down to. Okay, these guys are almost gone. And now they are gone. We do... Let's see, once that little area kind of gets conceded, then uh, we'll take that spot. There they are. They're, that's what I want you to be doing. Take that spot. You already own it. Just go ahead and take it. Alright. Let's see. That's, uh, that's nothing that I really want to worry with. There we go. Keep pushing. We'll, we need to come up here and own Leon, though. But once that's there... Matter of fact, let's go ahead. Come on. All of you guys, too. Yep, you're coming right here. So I can take a look at it, which is not too bad. Oh, yes, please. Yeah, go up this way. We're going to slowly take these areas. Uh, you come up here. There's nothing there. Yeah, there's not much left of France now. They are down to... 5 million people, and that's spread out. They have a island here. I know. One of these was an island that they owned, I thought. It was probably this one. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is Corsica. And I'm pretty sure they owned it at one point, but uh, Italy took that over from them. They actually wanted a, launched an invasion. That's different. And uh, let's see, does Brazil, Brazil done this down here? Nope. They also own French Guiana down here. So, they have a few other small islands posted about, which when that happens we need to be prepared, because I think we'll get them. Or at least we'll be close to getting them. Very important that we do get it. Okay. These guys are just kind of pressing around down here. They know they can win, but they could definitely use help to do it quicker. Leopards. Alright. Keep going, guys. You've almost got this spot taken out. And then we'll go after this little town. Villurban. Villurbane, maybe. Not sure. Alright. Seem to be doing a good job. There we go. Now let's move on that town and that'll be it. That's all we'll have to take. And then we'll own all of this little area. That 5 million is about to go down a little bit. 4.5. This area is pretty well populated though. I'm pretty sure they have at least 2 to 3 million in this area alone. So we obviously we, we got to have that. More population to support. More that's underneath my thumb. And while we're up here doing this, look at this, we're making so much money. Let's see how we're doing on things. Uh, agriculture, we're fine. Freshwater, we're fine. Timber, we're good. Petroleum, we're coming up on a breaking point. We need to be looking forward to that. Coal, fine. Metal, fine. Uranium, we are not making enough, but I want to kind of wait for this war to end before I do uranium. Electricity, we're doing just fine. Consumer goods, we're doing good. On a breaking point of industry goods. And military, we're fine. So, could definitely probably go in there and delete some of those facilities that are not quite big enough. But uh, we won't worry so much with it right now. Come on, let's go from our side. Let's get it. Okay, whew. A lot going on right there. Now then. They'll hit here, then hopefully they'll hit here, and then finally go after the capital. What's there? Uh, that's some kind of transport. Okay. Troop transport. Not going to worry with it. Oh, there's a puma. Let's take all these guys. I want you to come run down here too. 
And there's something in this town. It's a, another Puma. Well, we're going to bring him down. Come help out on this, you know, French front, which has now become literally next to nothing. All right. Take that garrison out, please. Thank you. Take out their AMX uh, anti-tank vehicle. Oh, we were under attack by somebody else. Who is that? We are under attack by Spain. Okay. That's fine. We're, we got units in the area and... Wow, where are they going? No clue. I want to see where they go. We need reinforcements. There is no way. They're, see, they're dying in the middle of the sea. They don't have that kind of fuel, but they're trying to get all the way over here. Let's see. Can they make it? Nope. They died. They were trying to get right here. They've got uh, some Caribbean islands on their side. What is that? United Kingdom. That's France. Yeah, I want to take these islands if I can. That make great little points to start invading elsewhere over here. And they're good refueling positions. We need reinforcements. Okay, come on. I want you to push right here. Take that. All right, lots going on. We need to. Hopefully, we've got units coming back. I don't even think they are coming back though. Engineers, Pumas. Let's see. Do have artillery and AA right there. We're gonna let go, and we're gonna bring these guys down here. Let them do their job. What's going on up here? We have retaken this, and we are now pushing. On Russia in the north. We need reinforcements. Yeah, and you know what? While this is going on, I'm gonna try to build out this road. <laughs> I'm building this road so that maybe they can, if they retake it, they'll be building it. And if they don't, we'll, of course, we'll be building it up. And maybe we can create a nice little link over here. Yeah, just here, south of Severomorsk. Severomorsk. At Murmansk. That's what. It, that's the. T Why don't they name that the same thing? Oh, they're. That's actually a town. That's not a military facility. Okay, we'll let them do that. I'm not too worried about that northern flank. I'm worried about it if it gets like down here, and then we're kind of in trouble. They are pushing through Belarus. I, I wish I could help you, Belarus, but I can't. Okay, we've got troops entering the area. Push back Spain. I'm going to go ahead and pay off some loans here. Might as well take some of this time and knock out some that loan money. So I can make some more. we got satellites available for launch. Ah, I won't worry about it. We'll launch them all at one time. Reconnaissance. We can go ahead and build up ten of you. So it takes 10 communication, 10 reconnaissance, and 20 missile defense to create an adequate net. Okay, these guys are... Yeah, just divide and conquer. That's that's all you've got to do here. We'll go ahead and send a few units over here. Just so we can go ahead and claim the final pieces here. If Italy, hopefully they won't want to attack us, but they could. If they do, we'll knock them out too, and then we'll build a nice little road here. Alright, these guys are... There you go. Take that spot. Go ahead and take out Toulon. Let's see, where are they down to now? 2.9 million people. Hey, give us peace and then also give us money. Uh, no thank you, France. It's not how this works. You give me money, and then we might go to peace. But I want your territory. So, no. Okay, we're gonna go ahead. Wow, that just took an extra spot for me. Hopefully that lasts. No, it won't. Yeah, go ahead and send your guys down there and get hurt. Yeah, keep doing, keep doing it. That's fine. You can soften them up for me. We're gonna build up the supply line in the meantime, and keep pushing on Spain. Oh, that's a little bad pocket. That's not good. Uh, come on, guys. I need you to give them the supply. Alright. 
Oh, oh come here. What are you doing running off over here? Oh, because there's Spanish troops way behind the lines. Well, that's good. I know that seems bad to most people, but that's actually good for me. Because that means they're so far behind the lines that they cannot receive supply and we can just pick them off. Yeah, go ahead, let's do ahead go ahead and do that. We'll just you have no supply left. Which means that you can't hurt me. Like watch this, I'll send one guy in there, one guy right here. We'll send uh two guys down here in this area and just have fun. Yeah, go ahead. We'll just take care of these units for you. Making you really weak again down here, and then we'll take you on. Go ahead, come on, take this. Con Sir Mayor, we'll take that. They are. They have St. Denis is there, which is way down here. This is the French capital. This little 264,000 man town in the middle of the Indian Ocean off the coast of Africa. Yep, they're pretty much done. Well, we won't take that for a long time. We might be at war with France for a while until they just decide that they can't keep it up and they'll give up. Which is okay. Uh, I'm alright with that. Okay. Now, there's two parts to the Spanish focus that we have to go for. We have to take out this area. Um, something about the northern Spain area you know I'm trying to think what is, what is this area gonna be called uh, the Burgos military area I guess is a good idea the North Madrid area which is what this really is because there's Madrid and then we also have to take out the Barcelona area uh, those are where they create a lot of troops that's where they uh, have a lot of their population we have to go for these areas go ahead and take that spot back please we don't want them having any areas to build up in. Okay. And once that's gone, uh, this area is really not that bad. It looks like it is because it's so far away and they've got the naval base. It's not. I can easily get there once I take this out. Once I take out this area, that's an easy take. Once I take out the Barcelona area, it's kind of like the entire Mediterranean coast is hard. You, they're so packed in together. Uh, they're getting fed by Madrid. They're getting fed by uh, Almeria's base down here, and they're also getting fed by uh, Sevilla's desk, uh, desk base. Goodness gracious. So, as you can see, we're already starting to do this nice push. We need to get a barracks in here somewhere. I don't see it. Oh, well, it might be right here. Huesca. Have we taken Andorra? Yes, we have. We took Andorra already. And we're dealing with a bunch of engineers. But we have so much you know, military down here already. Look at this. We're, we're already hitting the outskirts of Barcelona. Now we don't have as much as we could when we're doing this battle. But it's alright. Keep going, guys. Yeah, surround that town. Vic Victoria Gasteas. We can forget that town. We got it. Bilbao, Getzko, uh, Baracaldo, Castro Diales. Okay. It's alright. The main one is Barcelona. We take out Barcelona now. There's 43 million people in Spain. And by taking out Barcelona, we'll take 2.5 million of them. And not to mention the area around it is very heavily populated. How much does Spain have? I mean, France have now. 2.4 million. So they've lost all of their mainland holdings except for this itty bitty town of Jersey, which is actually a, the UK's city and island. So they've lost everything pretty much. That there's no coming back from this for France. They they won't be able to do anything. It's going to be up to me to take out their, you know, get over here and start going after Africa, maybe. Uh, going after South America and then doing little island hopping campaigns to take stuff. 
Which reminds me, we're getting just about time. I guess maybe when I get the United Kingdom, Ireland, Spain, and Portugal, I get these guys. I might, uh... Let's see, do they have any military units on these islands? They do not. What I might end up having to do is... The main one is probably going to be Cuba. Not even that. Like, There's got to be an island, a good island somewhere that I can build up... Uh... Jump, uh, jump troops. I need to build up some jump troops somewhere. But by doing that, I will... I'll probably end up doing it. I'm just looking for a good spot. L let's see if we can find one. Maybe down here in the Spa these Spanish islands. See, so I'm trying to build, think of a spot where I can build up a good amount of troops to go jumping in on islands and taking them for myself. And uh, also to jump in on mainland areas. Because what I'd love to do is take out one of these, uh, let's see, not Venezuela, but maybe take out uh, Uruguay. Yeah, Uruguay's got a nice land fabrication facility on it. Take out, you know, Uruguay and start building up forces there. Uh, then maybe make a campaign against like Paraguay or Bolivia or Chile, somebody off over here. The same thing down here in Africa. Go ahead and start building up troops. Uh, main thing is get in South America. South America, you start taking it, then you can start getting ready to go after the United States. The United States takes a long time to take if you don't have a whole lot of troops. So, Also, if I could get somewhere over here in East Asia, which that would probably be... Uh, Cambodia is against China. So that might be one. They have a ton of units, though. What else is around? Indonesia. Singapore would be awesome, but that's so far away. But yeah, you have to kind of work your way around. But alright guys, taking a quick look again. We are about to be touching Russia here. Because Belarus can't hold their crap together. And they're well that's because they have no money. I could probably gift them like a couple mil you know, a couple billion just to keep them afloat long enough to uh maybe push back a little bit we're doing well up here still we didn't we don't have as much land as we did but it's better than them pushing on our port here of bad so but yeah all right not bad and oh yeah we took all of france duh, duh, how can i forget that but all right guys i appreciate you guys appreciate you guys so much for watching i'm gonna have to end it right here but uh yeah uh be sure to check it out next time all right see you then